Hey guys, what's up, Gary? Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. It's going to be a reading for your immediate future, your situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. Keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person that you're dealing with to flip off it how you need to. Also, keep in mind this is a general reading. So it may not resonate for everybody. But if it does with you today, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Alright, Aries. Immediate future for Aries. So if you're working on a project or like something for work, you're coming in as the Empress. You could be dealing with the Taurus, but you're like very stable, abundant as hell. Possibly working on like a lot of different things. So here's Eight of Pentacles for Aries. Ooh, working on something new. This could be with a person. This could be something at a distance for you. A job, um, an opportunity, something passionate. Some of you could be trying to start a family as well. Show me this Empress for Aries. All right, wow. The Page of Cups and the Ten of Cups. Somebody is seeing you as long term. They're seeing you as wifey. They're seeing you, you know, in your lightness and all your glory. And they want to offer you something. They want to flirt with you. They want to talk to you. This person could have been kind of watching you or you could work with this person. Um... They also could have let you down in the past. So now they're like, oh shit, what have I done? And they want to talk to you. Because there's a lot of love there with that Ten of Cups. This emotional fulfillment. This is an offer that makes you happy. Or, you know, possibly an apology. With the Five of Cups there. Looks like you've really grown, grown yourself, your abundance, that type of thing. Yeah. They want something stable. They want something long term. Something grounded. You're building a foundation. You're building a freaking empire. Whatever it is that you've been working on. Show me the seven of cups. One card, please. Seven of cups. You may have more than one offer. The knight of cups. Yeah, you may have more, more than one person approach you. This is a love offer coming towards, but you may need to do like a balancing act here with the Six of Pentacles and the Seven of Cups. Um, you may have multiple options to choose from. So we have the messages. We have the night coming in. We have something, you know, trying to balance out here. You may be confused or kind of wishy-washy about this. Okay. You may feel like there's competition around this, or there definitely could be. Um, maybe on your side, or there's, I don't know, but the Six of Pentacles with the Seven of Cups. Like, you may have things pulling your attention here. That could just be work. But with the Seven of Swords and the Five of Wands, this could be like somebody intentionally trying to start drama in this. This is kind of a sneaky energy, like somebody creating drama. So they may kind of, you know, kind of see you in your light here doing something new or working on something new, something passionate. And this person is having some regrets here. So they want to come back and offer this cup of love. What is this? Um, why? Why this five of swords, five of wands, seven of swords? It's an ugly energy. It's all about decisions and choices. You know, we actually, it looks like we have, people could be like competing over you. Because we have the seven of cups, the two of wands, the six of pentacles, and kind of people fighting over you or fighting for this, or somebody may intentionally try to cause drama. Um, just because they see you, you know, they don't want to lose you is what it feels like if that's the way it's going. But there's choices that need to be made in order to move forward and balance things out. It's a general reading, so don't think everybody is being vindictive. 
Um, but you may have somebody, you know, it's whatever this is that you're moving towards, this new project that you're working on, or it could be like a new relationship you're working on. Somebody is going to try to cause drama with that. Is the message I think we're trying to get here. How is Aries reacting? I don't think you're moving. How is Aries reacting to this? Yeah, you're taking it slow. The Knight of Pentacles, take it slow. Take it step by step, one step at a time. Okay. So let's move a knight in the deck. Because somewhere within this drama, this chaos, these options, and it could, it doesn't have to be like, um, you know, a third party. Somebody could be really focused on their work here. But there's a lot of love and a lot of stability around you and someone. Could be an Aquarius here. Oh, there definitely could have been like a messed up ending here that caused someone like a lot of stress. The eight and nine of swords. Really stressing someone out. So they're wanting to do whatever they have to do. Because it's like you're ending something. There's a new cycle beginning so whatever this new cycle is this beginning means something has to end right and somebody's going to try to cause some drama around that all right aries hope this helps hope this resonated so please make sure that you like and subscribe below you guys take care and i'll see you next time bye